Sometimes the most productive thing you can do is relax. Hello guys, today we're in Flushing, New York and my plan is to take myself on a self-care day but we don't want to pay Manhattan prices which is why I am in Flushing So I want to take you guys on a tour here Panghulu, oh my god Alright, we're finally inside the mall and we're heading to our first location which is a scalp treatment or body massage it's basically one of those places that's very common in china where you go and just do like a full like relaxation self-care kind of thing but it's not really common here in the states luckily we have flushing so let's go with me this is the place and i will see you guys once i'm inside this place is really cool okay see these are the options that you have spa and all that. Anyway, see you guys later. Okay, I just got changed into the, the like, special spa look and now we're about to get the spa. Very excited. It's so time. I'll show you guys what it looks like right now. It has this like crazy thing that's like for your scalp and it's supposed to like... You know what? I'm gonna voice over what it's good for. Okay, I think we're ready. I'm gonna go let her know right now. <laughs> All right, guys, as we start the massage, allow me to yap a little bit about life. I feel like ever since I graduated college, I finally feel like an adult who not only have to take care about the tasks that they have to do, but also their body and their mental health. I remember when I was in college, I used to be so reckless. I would pull all these all-nighters, be super sleep deprived all day, but just chuck down caffeine and push through the day you know if my hair is greasy i put on a cap and i go to the library it's just terrible for my health and i feel like it's finally catching up to me that's why i really wanted to almost find an excuse for myself to really relax and splurge on nothing else but my body it's interesting because i remember when i was younger my mom would always force me to do head massages for her because she had like really really bad sleep and insomnia and I just didn't get it I'm like why what is so difficult about falling asleep and lately I understand fully when life gets overwhelming when things are all over the place sometimes the most simple thing like sleeping becomes difficult and getting a head massage actually helps I think it stimulates the blood flow in your head and it just helps you almost relax and what you're seeing here is that instead of using just normal water for my hair massage they actually use this like herbal tonic and according to the lady who's doing my massage they used up to like 10 ingredients of chinese medicine that can help not just with sleep but with hair loss and lower blood pressure and now that i'm editing this video i can very proudly say that i did sleep super well that night and also i have been seeing less dandruffs i think it's because the medicine really helped me clear out like the clogged follicles on my skin and like the dryness of my scalp so now it's so much more like voluminous because it's less greasy if you know what i mean all right guys i just finished the hair treatment which was so good and look how voluminous my hair is right now so much volume and i'm so relaxed almost fell asleep but now i got changed back into my outfit and i'm gonna go get like an air picking treatment so that's gonna be exciting, first time ever. Let's go. I've always wondered what it feels like or what it really is because, I mean, it's just like taking out the discharges in your ears, but it was so relaxing and I feel like I could hear better after. So I think it's worth it and it's just like a very fun sensation and very fun experience to treat myself. Guys, I just had the most crazy experience ever, okay? This place is called Sooth Zen Spa and it's inside the New World Mall in Flushing. So if you're in New York and you know where Flushing is, come check it out, it's so nice. And they have all sorts of massage, but a lot of them are just very nourishing. They didn't pay me to say any of this, but 
I just really want to support this Chinese-owned small business. It's inside the New World Mall, guys. This is their business card. Search it up on Google. They are so nice. And also because it is like traditional Chinese medicinal practices, so I thought it would be really cool if more people could understand the hype. Anyways, now we're gonna go get some food because I am starving. It's like 1 p.m. haven't eaten anything, so let's get some food. This is, this is like a dream. But the only problem is I'm hell indecisive, so I don't know what I want to get. But I think I'm going to get something very nourishing and very difficult to find elsewhere. So let's have a look. Oh my goodness. Tian Bing Guo I love Tian Bing Guo Maybe I'll get that. Oh my god. Guys, this is hard. Everything looks so good. There's this place called Coco Nails. I want to get my nails done too and get my hair done. Probably not all in one day though, but eventually. Oh my god, nails. If I have time, I'll do my nails. But I do need to go home and walk my dog. But look, this is basically like a Chinese mall where there's like a bunch of a lot of things. Ah, let's have a look at uh, makeup. Needed to get them. Oh my gosh, guys, look what I found. This is a cute date spot. If I have like a date, I'll bring them there. I love claw machine. Also, it's like actually like so much risk if someone's good at claw machines. I don't know why. Look, this is the cutest claw machine bear I've seen. And the duck. I actually really want this. You know what? I'm gonna give it a try. How much is it? Three token. How much is a token? Oh, a dollar is a token. Three dollars for that. Dude, this is like a... This is a solo date for real now. Yo, this is crazy. Because like, if you think about it, five cash only, five for a token, which means you basically have to get more than five because each game is three tokens. So psychologically, you can never just exchange for five tokens because you're going to have two leftover tokens. And what are you going to do with two leftover tokens? So, oh my gosh, this is cute too. It's like, it's like a little bag. Okay, I'm going to try just, just for the plot, guys, for the plot. Oh, 